Hello my beautiful people, welcome back to another gorgeous day in the garden. Um, I'm having a lot of fun playing with these Amsterdam Pearl pigments, the uh, Amsterdam Pearl Violet and Pearl Blue. And we just did one other pour, which was the last one that you guys saw. Turned out really, really cool and I wanna play with them some more. So we are trying a 16 ounce split cup from paintpourstore.com. This one is five chambers and has a handle, which is really cool. And I'm using a 20 by 20 inch gallery wrap canvas. Now I have this sitting on a wood panel and then it's sitting on a spinner. So it's not very, very spinny, but it is gonna spin a little bit, which is fine for what I need. So move that over for a second if I can. Okay, and I'll show you the colors. The first one we're using is a combination of these two beautiful ones. This is Golden Prussian Blue and uh, Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics in Emerald Green sort of a play on that mysterious color, which was the sapphire blue and the emerald green, but this is so pretty. I love this. Everything is mixed with Mix4 tonight. You can get your own mix by emailing Krista at Krista8974 at gmail.com. Beautiful, luscious, creamy, thick, mm, delicious. It's a good thing you can't eat paint. <laughs> Okay. I probably would. <laughs> I probably would. Some of it looks so good though. On top of ice cream. Okay, so this one is the pearl blue, which is here. Amsterdam pearl blue. And this one is the pearl violet, which is over here. And they look pretty much the same while they're wet. Well, I can actually see a little bit of a violet tint to this one but we'll see how they show up when they're dry. So that's the pearl violet. Beautiful, okay. Then we are using one of my favorite colors ever, Artist Loft Metallic Cobalt Blue. Just, I love this. Love, love, love this color, okay. And last but not least, we are using the Golden Prussian Blue all by itself. Now, I do have some 24 karat gold from Deco Art Americana Decor Metallics left over from my last pour. I'm not gonna put that in the split cup, but I'm gonna pour into a puddle of gold. So, let's layer the split cup. Okay, I'm gonna start on one side with that mysterious color. I'm gonna fill it up all the way. I love this, it's so beautiful. And now we're gonna use the pearl blue in the next chamber. do a four coat chamber of secrets <laughs> and now we're going to use the metallic cobalt in the center chamber okay and now i'm going to use the prussian next to that Pearl Violet on the last chamber. Okay. All right. So I have some drips that I scraped off my table. I'm going to pour those on as a base coat. Actually, I think I'm going to pour some into a cup and thin it out because I think it's pretty thick. I am going to tilt it. I'm not going to spin it out, but I like I want to be able to use the spinner to see if we can get some more of those beautiful curvy lines. And then I did say I was going to pour into a puddle of gold. Center. Are you ready, husband of awesomeness? Yes, my love. Okay, we're gonna I go am ready. start in the center. Here we go. And I am just gonna rotate this slightly.
that's pretty cool. I like that. Okay. So now I'm going to get rid of this contraption. Let's torch this. I love that color, that mysterious color. So pretty. Okay, we're going to go off this way first. Let's see. See a water bear with a mm -hmm. glorious tail. Little bits of dried paint messing up my composition. Okay. You see a what? A water a bear? Water bear with a glorious tail. I love these colors together. So oh, yeah. pretty. Wave fly. Really cool. All right, awesome. Okay, so that was fun. <laughs> I'm very excited about this one. I love this mysterious color that we made that sparkly blue green with the Prussian blue and the emerald green. And I love the paint or the Prussian in there contrasting against that and the metallic cobalt. And I'm very excited to see how the two pearls dry if they're going to actually show up. I do actually see a little bit of the pearl violet, but that might just be my mind playing tricks on me. <laughs> but we'll see. I'm happy that this is all pretty solid in here. So when it does show up, it's gonna be pretty solid too. So this is cool. Very cool. I like that curve that's in there. All right, I'm going to stop there <laughs> and I'll show you when it's dry. We'll be right back. Probably go like this. Now it looks like a water bear. What? Yeah, I'm not sure what a water bear actually looks like, but okay. Okay, so here we are a few days later, and it is dry. This was our mysterious color that we did. The uh, Prussian blue mixed with some of that emerald green. It gave us that gorgeous backgroundy color, and Prussian blue itself. And metallic cobalt and we used the pearl violet and the pearl blue from Amsterdam so I thought this was really really cool we do see some kind of white but then when we look at it from this direction I see that beautiful pearl violet shimmering it's so funny it actually shows up more in the shade I will show you guys after I shoot this part but this turned out really really pretty I love all these softer lines in here I think that this might be the pearl blue 
in here in these little wispy lines, but it's not showing up quite as much as I wanted. But I love this bird, it's so pretty right there. Look at all those gorgeous lines against the Prussian blue and that cobalt, and where it stayed really white. Really pretty stuff. I like this right here, these little like lightning shimmers. <laughs> So that's pretty nifty. That uh, definitely the pearl violet came through. <laughs> that's kind of cool. That's awesome. Magic trick. So <laughs> pretty neat. Um, so this was cool. Thank you guys so much for being here. I do appreciate all of you. I hope you will check out the other two pours I've done using the Amsterdam pearls because you know you learn something with every try. And it's been very, very interesting and enjoyable. And I've really enjoyed the art coming out of this. Thing. Just look at that. It's so, so neat. <laughs> so this was kind of awesome. Thank you guys so much for being here with us. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. And we'll see you real soon. Bye-bye.